from the part of the employees, I think they have to agree in surviving with a very minimum pay. I am agreeing to a large pay cuts in their regular salary at least for the uh, for one year. Tamil being the largest tourism concentration in the country, it has a huge involvement in terms of investment as well as employment. So while saying employment, definitely uh, there is people involved as a micro enterprise into their career also. That you can count either as a business enterprise or uh, employment itself. So at this time of COVID-19 impact where the whole world is going through a crisis, definitely Tamil is also affected like any other parts in the world and to come up with a resolution to help Tamil and bring it back to the previous stage, I think there are four specific parties involved. Number one, the investors who are mainly involved into micro enterprise and medium and big enterprise as well. Number two, the people, those who are working into these enterprises as uh, staffs or employees. Number three, the banks who have been supporting to these enterprises. And the, number four, the government and the uh, municipal corporation that has been uh, leaving tax out of these enterprises and the cash flow generated out of business that is done in Tamil. Now at this time of crisis, I think all four parties have to come together and claim their stake to help Tamil as well. So from the part of the employees, I think they have to agree in surviving with a very minimum pay. I am agreeing to a large pay cuts in their regular salary at least for the uh, for one year. That is number one. Number two, especially these micro enterprises are depending on the houses they have rented from the local owners. These local owners have to come up with a scheme to offer a a uh, very large cut in their monthly rental. That is uh, an, um, another way of intervention. Number three, the municipality and the government, they have to come up with a tax cut scheme, number one, and also grant scheme to help these uh, enterprise to survive um, by meeting their uh, working capital. On top of that, banks can help them by deferring their monthly loan and installment payments along with providing some extra grant for again meeting the working capitals. So by these four parties working together, I believe that you know Thomel will get enough endurance to survive during the crisis. And if they can survive at least for one year down the line, things will be better. That is what the symptoms are showing and it will be easier for the people and the enterprise of Thomel to grow back again.